On the 9th of June 1958, Her Majesty Queen Elizabeth II officially opened Gatwick Airport. The airport began life as a private flyers club in 1930, but by 1934 it had become a public aerodrome, providing regular flights to Paris. In 1939, with the start of World War II, the aerodrome was requisitioned as an RAF base until it was decommissioned in 1946. In 1950, it was officially designated as London's second airport, and then, after a £7.8 million renovation project, it was officially opened on this day and it has grown over time to become the busiest single runway airport in the world. Now, aeroplanes fascinate me. I mean, how does a gigantic chunk of metal like that fly through the sky? Now, I know it's got something to do with, with lift and thrust and, and drag, etc., but still, it is amazing to watch it actually happen. And one thing I do know is that they have to be moving at a pretty high speed to lift off. They have to use the runway to build up enough momentum before taking to the skies. I remember a few years back realizing that it is the same for us. You see, if we have things that we want to achieve, a goal that we're aiming for, then well, we're never going to achieve it by just standing still. We have to get moving and, and building up momentum if we also want to soar and reach our goal. But even then, you need something else to keep you going, to keep you flying high. And for me, I find this extra lift that I need from God. This is what a prophet named Isaiah wrote. But those who hope in the Lord will renew their strength. They will fly up on wings like eagles. They will run and not be tired. They will walk and not be weary. So if you have some place that you want to get to, then start today to move towards it and build up momentum as you go. And to help you get there, put your hope in God and get ready to fly.